Christique. You, okay. Now you're weaning yourself off it. I am. I actually, um, I don't see any reason to keep taking any of it. I think I'm weaned. I think I'm at the point now. We were three days off, one on, three days off. I think I'm okay to just stop now. I'm not getting any headaches or anything, and I think this has been about five days. When was the last time you took it? Let's see, one, two, three, four. Was it Friday? Five, no. Six. Six days since I had any. Isn't that interesting? So you weed yourself off every other day, then two days? Then two days, and then three days. And now you haven't had it in six days. Right. And look at how you're doing. Yeah. Six days. You have to wean yourself off so you don't get headaches and stuff, and I, I don't have any of those side effects, so I think I'm good to go without it. Well, when you think about it, you it just shows you right now, as long as you can keep your mind set in a positive way, you really don't need to be taking it. It seemed like it was creating more damage than good because mm -hmm. it was creating all these negative emotions and helplessness for a number of months while you were taking it. And you probably mm -hmm. weren't even telling me about it all. Uh -uh. No, I wasn't. And I didn't tell you until a few weeks ago. And you're off it for six days, so yeah. you really, you know you don't need it. And you know that it does worse things for you than good things right now when you take it. Right? Sure seems to be the case, yeah. Yeah. And last week when some things occurred and you were really upset and depressed, you took it and you didn't feel any symptom relief? No. Uh, what gave me the relief was our session and, like I said, it was like turning off a negative switch and turning on a positive one. It was instantaneous. It was just amazing. And then, you know, since then, over the weekend, there was one point when I really started having negative feelings and thoughts when I woke up and stuff, but I turned it around. Every time I turned it around, and I haven't plummeted into any kind of problem. Um, so, so you do have to exercise some effort to make to make absolutely. it work, like anything in life. Absolutely. It's not a pill you can take and your whole life has changed. No, it's definitely exercising the effort. But I'm learning how to do that. Um, even Saturday night, because Saturday night when we got down to San Diego, we realized we had left my trazodone. I was exhausted, but I was unable to sleep. Um, it was the longest night. And so throughout the night, I really had to focus on positive thoughts. Right. But I did. And I kept them very simplistic, and I think that's important. If you've got the racing thoughts, or you're having trouble sleeping, and you're in that low brainwave frequency mode, I think the important thing to tell yourself is, to keep it simple, I am happy, I am happy, I am happy. I mean, just something that you can almost say is a mantra rather than really having to think about it. Um, to keep out of that negativity mode, I'm just finding that if the simpler I keep it, it seems the more effective it is.